Following the substantial investments of both the financial resources and time, tea farmers in Kisoro district are reporting considerable losses associated with the tea project. Alozias Nizima, another local council leader of Suma village and the coordinator of the tea growers in the region expressed their disappointment with the government for not providing them with a tea factory. Amajani, chini kugamba amajani, mukutandi kama majani, abataka wa suma, tukatu wabona maka sente, tushakaru waha nerevo kamar. Amajani gatari kujenda misho, konka amajani kwa gaichiru bwire, akatari kabura, kukabuzire, abakozi ya abemerika. He asked the government to come and intervene or else they put load the tea plants. The government has been to take the water from the water. We have to take the water from the water. We have to take the water from the water. We have to take the water from the water. We have to take the after receiving guarantees regarding the demand for the tea, farmers expressed that they decided to abandon the cultivation of other crops in favor of tea. Regrettably, this shift has not resulted in any economic improvement and they are finding themselves in a state of worsening poverty. As the community people, we have a challenge. The past year, we are having our own lands, using for glazing, petrol keeping, after we get a product like Miruki and after. But let us per now government is keeping quiet. The government launched a project, tea project. As per now, there's no profit we are getting from the government, from the tea project. They reflected on the difficulties they have encountered, including instances of their children discounting their education as a result of their involvement in the tea cultivation. <laughs> This situation is further excavated by the low wages as farmers received 1,000 shillings per day. Shunkati, Honorable John Kamara, the member of parliament for the Bafumbira North, expressed his frustration regarding the Uganda Development Bank inability to provide funding for the construction of a tea factory. Because you see, According to Honorable John Kamara, President Museveni made a promise to build a two-line tree factory and directed the Uganda Development Bank to take action. However, these initiatives have ultimately been unsuccessful. So this, actually, was looking for money from UDB. This time, because of the suffering of my people, UDC must bring free money and we invest it together. After all, I'm a member of parliament. He says the much billion of money are wasted in the tea project. He requested that the government conduct an investigation into the reasons behind the growth of Rwanda's tea market while Uganda's tea industry is struggling. He advised the tea farmers not to approach the tea, asking them to be patient.